Hey everybody, in this video we're going to take a look at the uh, Open Bomb for SolidWorks Settings dialog and kind of help us get started. So I've gone ahead and installed uh, the Open Bomb add-in for SolidWorks and let's take a look at the Settings dialog. So the Settings dialog is kind of broken into a couple of areas. At the top, um, we're not going to change this. We're going to sign in with our Open Bomb account here. Um, and then, you know, most often we're going to be creating multi-level bombs. I like to work in multi-level most often. So there's an area next for bomb properties. These are filters that help uh, tell OpenBOM what information to extract from SolidWorks. So there's one needed for both um, a bomb and catalog. The, uh, the uh, bomb properties filter is, is pretty simple and is usually empty. As a matter of fact, um, we automatically put part number, quantity, and thumbnail into the bomb. So uh, typically speaking, I don't put any other properties in here and you'll see why in just a moment. All this other information is stored with the item, uh, and the item is uh, is part of the Open Bomb catalog. So it's in the uh, it's in the catalog filter where you want to put all of the uh, all of the other properties that you want to bring to Open Bomb. I know that can be a little confusing, but just try it out and see what happens. So I've added configuration name, description, and some other things in my um, in my catalog filter. So what this means is both the bomb and catalog properties will be brought together in Open Bomb to build your villa materials. So finally, there's a setting here for template. I'm gonna deal with, uh, uh, with that in another video. We can set a, we can set a template uh, here. And um, there's some grouping for part numbers and configurations. If you check this box, we will group configurations uh, with the same part number. So that's really useful if you're doing um, configurations for open and closed um, positions and things, but yet you want them to have the same part number. And finally, um, it, if you're using the Open Bomb cloud settings, we can send uh, CAD files and other PDFs and drawing things up to the cloud. I'm going to go ahead and choose my cloud storage, my preferred cloud storage, your Google Drive. I'm just going to go ahead and authenticate. So, so there, so we're all ready. So, on in the next video, we'll make our, we're going to create our bill of material, and you'll see what it looks like. Thanks.